Derek Wittenberg is an NC State basketball legend and coach. You've heard about the 1983 national title ending, Lorenzo Charles buzzer beating dunk off Derek's high arching air ball. Well, now Derek can add the title benefactor to his many accomplishments. He launches the Derek Wittenberg Foundation tonight, but first, he's here to tell us about it. Derek, it's so nice to have you here. Great being here. I'm excited, yeah. and uh, thanks for having me. Absolutely. Do you ever get tired of talking about that ending to that mm, game? Well, <laughs> it was a pass. Oh. Oh, not okay. a shot. So I just, me. Want, I just want to clarify that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's talk about this foundation. What will it do? Well, uh, we're so excited. Uh, Sheraton approached me uh, mm -hmm. about giving back to the community. And uh, they said, we don't have a foundation. Would you start one? I oh. said, sure. Anything for kids. And uh, and we all decided that uh, the best way to do that is to, you know, to, to target college kids uh, that have hardships in college. Mm -hmm. And uh, so we're going to fundraise for, for that uh, purpose, and uh, we're excited about it. Uh, we have filed. We're up and running. Yeah. We're ready to go. Okay. And uh, we're anxious to, to launch this thing tonight and let the world know. Okay, so this will benefit students at three schools in Raleigh, right? We're going to three schools. We're going to start with three schools. Mm -hmm. uh, eventually, hopefully, we're going to reach across the state. But we're going to start with St. Aug, Shaw, and NC State. Mm -hmm. And I think that's a wonderful way to start this uh, venture and give it back to the community. Okay, and you'll fundraise. You have a golf tournament coming up in a few months? August 3rd is going to be our golf tournament. That's going to be our signature event. We hope to raise fifty thousand mm -hmm. dollars. We, we're going to get it done. Okay. And we're excited about it. I think we got a lot of community support already, and uh, hopefully you can come out and join us. Yeah, maybe so. How do students apply? Well, the schools are responsible for really setting the criteria for the students. Mm -hmm. They have to let the students know that what the what the criteria is and what it's about. Okay. And hopefully, once they decide on the students, they'll come to the tournament and we'll be able to give them a check. And hopefully, that that would help them in their endeavor. Okay, who you got, Golden State or the Rockets? Oh, this this is easy. <laughs> Golden State. I have yes, a Steph Curry. I have a, I have a Steph Curry story. Oh, tell me. So I was at Fordham University. I was supposed to go recruit Stephen Curry, oh. and we signed another kid. That big was a mistake. Big mistake. <laughs> Wasn't a good idea. <laughs> All right, Atlanta or Cleveland? Oh, of course. But LeBron James. Yes, that, that, yes. That, that's easy. That's okay, easy. Steph Curry's known as the chef. Yes. So is Dwight Howard. If you your nickname? You have to. <laughs> <laughs> who should be chef and who shouldn't be well, chef? I gotta have go with Curry because he's yeah. a guard. That's I, you've right. never seen a big chef. That's right. In your restaurant, like, right? He's six eleven. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. It's gonna be hard to move around. Stephen Curry, he's he's limber. He's elusive. He sure is. He can is. get around and make things happen. Yeah, these are some exciting that's why finals. He was, that's why he was the MVP. You got it, North Carolina <laughs> standout. Thank you so much. So nice to meet you. Thank you.